Okay, bye heads. Happy Sunday. I hope everyone enjoyed their weekend. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and your subscription. I hope my messages, um, even if it's just one sentence in that message that helps you, I hope that it resonates and it helps you to um, cultivate a life of love, a life of understanding, and a life of freedom. So I got a few channel messages. I'm going to go with the first one. Well, it's really the second one, but I'm still, it's the first one. How about that? Um, the divine, God, whoever, however, whatever name you use, how about that? The higher power, the creator, whatever name you choose to use is very proud of you. God is saying he's so, so proud of you. He's proud of your growth. He's proud of how you are willing to separate in order to elevate. How you're willing to not only expose and reveal yourself so that you can become free and magical, I might add. Whoever I'm speaking to, you very, very magical, baby. Very magical. You know what I'm saying? I mean, a beautiful heart. Someone who is full of fire. Someone who is a very sexy, might I add. I don't know now. You're very sexy now. You're very sexy. And you understand how to be divine and still live in the matrix. I mean, it's no ex we can escape from the matrix spiritually, but we're here physically. You understand? Yeah. But the matrix is more matrix is also more about a mindset. And it's just amazing how you created this divine matrix within your mind. You've opened or unlocked, not even created, but you've unlocked by healing, by establishing deep roots. So when that they flourish, they will not bend or break on here these roots so when they flourish I said flourish but when they flourish flourish they won't bend or break is what I'm hearing so these roots let's see I don't know what those roots are about but I'm definitely hearing the God telling me to tell you <laughs> That he's so proud of you. So proud of you letting go of everything that no longer served you. So proud of the boundaries you set. So, so proud of the spirit of gratitude that you have. So proud. So proud that you understand his powers. So proud that you understand the powers around you. So proud that you acknowledge. So proud that you decided to weather the seas with him, with the divine, with God, the creator, the most high. He wants me to let you know he's so proud. And there is about to be a blessing, a opening, a door that is going to open in your favor. This move is going to be very powerful. It's going to be, man, it's going to clear the room out. It's going to have, it's going to have folks thinking. You hear me? It's going to have folks wondering how. Because you've sacrificed so much to reverence, to reverence the divine, to reverence God. 
you decided to go within and quiet your mind so that you may come out a rose in concrete. Ooh, child, close. my eyes was closed, child. Open them up. Look what's at the bottom of the deck. The roses kiss. You may come out a rose in concrete. You hear me? There are many stories and testimonies that you have to tell. These stories and these testimonies are going to help others see beyond the illusions. It's going to help others weather their broken seas and their trials and tribulations that they might go through. It's going to help others close out their karmic encounters. It's going to give others a higher view, a higher perspective. Oh my God, look what fell out. Seeing beyond is going to help give people help give people a, a, another view another perspective ain't that just what i was saying it's going to help heal their hearts it's going to break open and cut down generational curses what god has put in you is meant to let be let out right now this is the time this is the time He wants you to know he's proud of you. He's proud of the things you've done to help people see beyond their proverbial senses. He's proud of you for helping people heal their broken hearts by sharing your broken hearted stories. He's proud of the lion that has awakened in you. Ooh, this is good. He's proud. He's proud that you have helped break generational curses. He's proud. He's proud that you've helped people. He's so proud. And he's wanting you to know right now, whatever you wish, whatever you wish for, your wish is granted. Because he's so, 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 so proud of you. So proud of you is what I'm hearing. Whatever you want. The biggest thing that you need in your life is about to come into fruition. Because he said he's proud of you. He's about to gift you whatever you desire. Because he's so, 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 so proud of you. He's so proud of you. Because you decided to follow your purpose. And on your purpose, you will be powerful. You will be great. You will be successful on your path of purpose. God. And y'all know I get loud when the messages are loud. But my, the messages in my ear, I mean the messages in my heart, in my soul, the intuitive messages are so loud because I hear, I hear singing and I hear praising and I hear laughing and I just hear joyful noises because someone is being celebrated in the spiritual realm. For the things that they have gone through. That they have always given over to a higher power. They always knew. That the divine was going to never leave them. Or never forsake them. They celebrated the small. They never despised their small beginnings. But yet they celebrated them. I'm seeing a graduation. I'm seeing a crown. Child. Yeah. Them messages is loud because I hear the music is so loud. Intuitively, I'm hearing so I just feel like I have to keep getting louder for you guys but i know that i need to calm down because you, whew, i'm gonna have to end this this is the message